Hi guys, I'm back again. I have my, um, I have a haul here from Rose Girls. This is from her April pre-order, I think. I think it was April. It was March or April, um, and it just recently was sent out in May, so I've had it a few days, um, and she also did a ready to ship afterward, um, but I'm just going to go ahead and get into it. So this first one here is a sample in Just Another Day in Paradise. This one is Ocean Bamboo Hemp and Bergamot. This is really nice. I The Ocean is mainly what I smell, but I don't necessarily know if... I know what bamboo or hemp smell like. I normally don't like bamboo, but whatever the bamboo oil that I don't like, I don't smell that in here. So it's either a different oil or I just can't smell it. Um, I don't really smell bergamot either. This is just like a nice beachy, oceanic, fresh air scent. I like that. I would get that again. Um, okay, and then I got one loaf. She did offer loaves. And this pre-order, um, she offered, I think, loaves, mini muffins, and, um, like, her mini melters. I got one loaf, and then the rest I got mini melters of. But this one is Palo Santo and Peep Cake. So I had this before um, in mini melters, I think. And I liked this so much that I wanted to get a whole loaf in it. Her loaves are hefty. Like, they're very heavy. Um, <clears throat> I don't know if the wax she uses is, like, denser than other vendors. But they definitely feel really heavy um and i would get a lot of melts out of this one but i feel like the loaf i had before in this was the palo santo was different like i feel like it was a more cologne palo santo and this one is a more woodsy palo santo so i don't know if it's just me yeah i don't know if it's just me um or if she used a different palo santo oil in this than the one i had previously because the one i had previously it was like maybe two years ago um that I had it. I still like it. I think I prefer the masculine oil, but I'm hoping maybe it is just the same oil and I and the one that I had before I let cure and it um developed into a more masculine scent. So this is nice. Her peeps cake is really great. Um it's like a fluffy vanilla cake type of scent. Um so I'll let that one cure and I'll see I'll see how it turns out. Um okay. Next, I have Orange Dreamsicle Marshmallow Milkshake. This one is Orange Dreamsicle Marshmallow and Vanilla Milkshake. This is pretty much just a nice cream sugar scent. Um, the vanilla in here is really creamy. Uh, I like her marshmallow and I like her vanilla milkshake scent. Um, yeah, it's like a, an even creamier Orange Dreamsicle, which I like orange scents and I like vanilla scents, so I love that one. Really good. Um, and next, here I have strawberry peppermint coconut milk. Um, so this one is, I would say, heaviest on the peppermint. She has a very strong peppermint. And then I can smell the strawberry. It's like a fresh picked strawberry scent, I think. And then um, the coconut is kind of just in the background. This is good. I was a little bit iffy about this one. Um, but I think she blended these together really nice. It's just a nice, like, soothing scent. And I think, I think this one will be really good. For like in the bedroom okay what do i have here next um these next two are kind of similar this one first one is ponds come so this is salty sea air green foliage coriander cedar oak moss jasmine and bergamot and i cannot smell any of those scents this just this just smells to me like a fresh like a men's soap kind of scent um it's very yeah, it's very, like, masculine to me. I guess it could be a unisex scent. I don't know if that's necessarily masculine. But it is definitely fresh. It's, like, soapy to me. So, if you were ever to get this, don't expect... I was expecting, I guess, it to be, like, a very woodsy scent. Like, I thought it would smell dirtier, and it doesn't. It's very clean. But I like it. Don't get me wrong. Um, I like it a lot. It'll be perfect for when I want something that's really clean. Um, okay, and then I have crawler hunting. This one is dirt, rain, and concrete. And this, the dirt and the concrete are the strongest notes in this. Um, the concrete is like a wet concrete. So, like, if you were at the pool, um, you know, that just, like, wet type of after rain concrete scent. That's what it smells like to me. I don't know if I love this. I went to... 
get like mini melters next time she offers them in blue sugar because I really like blue sugar mixed with dirt and I want to try to mix this with blue sugar um because there's another scent from another vendor I'm thinking of that it's like blue sugar dirt and some kind of flower um which her rain scent is very floral to me so I might try to mix that or get some blue sugar to mix with that to see uh, okay, next I have Secret Garden. So Secret Garden is vine, tomato, leaves, soil, uh, teakwood, and cedar. This is strongest on the tomato. It really smells like a legit tomato plant to me. Um, leaves, I don't know that I smell leaves. I can smell a little bit of the soil. And then the cedar. Um, this does, it's very reminiscent of like working in the garden or working with tomato plants. This is really nice. Um, I have a scent from another vendor that's really similar to this um, that I really love. So it's nice to know that I could get this from multiple different people. Um, but this is great. It'll be nice for like, I don't know, like summer evenings, you know, with the windows open. Because we do have a garden right outside. Okay, two more here. Goodnight Moon is Sweet Lavender, Pink Sugar, Peppermint, and Birthday Cake. And I've had this one before. I love this. Mm. Um, I can smell all those things. The lavender, the peppermint, the birthday cake. Um, the pink sugar, I can't really smell too much unless I'm like looking for it. But just mixed together, this is like the most calming, like gentle, just nice, girly bedroom scent. I really love this. I will order this again and again. Um, really perfect. I like her lavender. I like all lavender, I think. And then another lavender scent here is Abracadabra. So this one is her sweet lavender, the olive branch lush type, um, and lavender cucumber sage. And this is great. I had this last summer and I wanted to get it again. Um, I can definitely smell the sweet lavender, the olive branch, if you've ever smelled that. It's a very distinctive smell. I don't know that I can smell like cucumber sage, but definitely it's like a lavender olive branch scent to me. Um, it's super strong. The third is like a 10 out of 10 on this one. Um, and it's just like a great like spa zen type of scent. It, it doesn't smell like zen if you're picturing her zen, but um, yeah, it's just like a great like spa, calming, clean type of scent. Um, and I really like that one. So that's all I have. Um, short and sweet. I do have one more. I have one more vape order that I need to make a video on. So I'll be back with that. Thanks for watching, guys.